What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, I have a little stand, mi microphone stand, I bought it on Amazon. And I remember this saying it didn't work on Yeti mics, which is uh, what I used to record uh, my voice on my PC. But I was reading some of the reviews and it says that you can make it work, so uh, I'm gonna just unbox it for you guys and then go through the setup process and show you guys how it looks with my Yeti mic. And I do have the Blackout Yeti mic, it's the, well it's the black version. And we have some very basic instructions, so basically mount it, put the clasp and then add, attach the, the little, the stand. Pretty simple. I've had this for like a month now and it's just been collecting dust. And I've just been really, really lazy to do it, so, you know. Today is the day. So, throw that box to the side. This is the class. Have the class. I have the the stand holder. I'm assuming, and then the actual microphone stand. So, let's see the illustration, cause you know. Instructions weren't so clear on this. Huh. Okay, so. Okay, so you spin it like this to get it to pull back. Alright, to your desired length. Then you would attach. Hmm, what the hell would I attach? Okay, so this is gonna go like that. And then... Oh, okay, so then this simply... All right. So this, this is where, um... Attach this part of it. And then tighten it um, up with that. I think so. Alright, so yeah. So I don't know what the fuck this thing is for. So. Oh, that's probably just to, that's to hold up your mic, maybe? <sighs> you guys will just figure this out on the way. So I'll show you guys a little step by step how things go. But as of right now, this goes on to your desk. And then you attach this and then tighten it with this screw. Then you just connect your microphone, I'm assuming, to that, to, to the this end. Because I have seen a hole like that in my Yeti. So let's go set this up and I'll show you guys how it looks. Alright guys, so I finally set it up. That clasp down there was probably the hardest part. But you just got to keep on uh, rotating it till it fits. So righty tighty, lefty loosey. Then you attach the, the stick, like I said, and you tighten it with the screw back there until it's nice and tight. And then the arm, you just extend it to whatever length you want it. I have mine with the Yeti. So with what I did with the Yeti is I took it out of the mount I had it before. Uh, I used the included, um, like there was this little thing in there that came with the microphone attachment. And I unscrewed it from that. I screwed it onto the this uh this screw right here and then I just screwed it into the Yeti hole right here. So I know technically this isn't meant for the Yeti, but it seems pretty secure to me and you can rotate it and I I really think it can hold its weight. So far it has. Just make sure to tighten this up here and you won't have any issues. So right there it's pretty tight, as tight as I can tight it. And overall it sounds pretty good. I just have my cable running through the back there. And I think it's it's nice for the price. I think I got it for like 10 bucks. I'll leave the link down below if you guys want. And uh, overall, it's a nice cheap Yeti stand. And I have my keyboard right here. Got my little Caesars packets over there. And then I'm just got my... Uh, my it, it freed up a whole bunch of space because I had my stand right there. The one that came with the Yeti. And it was just like you could hear the clicks. And I mean, you can still probably going to hear the clicks now. But at least I'll, it'll be a little bit more elevated. And you won't hear it as much. So yeah. So definitely a good purchase. I really enjoy it. 
I should have done this a couple weeks ago, but you know, hey, what can we do? So I'll see you guys in the next video, and peace.